Well, hello, and welcome to Marty Plays Games. We are on the weekend stream. It is a Sunday, and we are taking a look at Grand Mountain Adventure Wonderlands on the PC. This is a game from the 10th of March 2022 from Tluva AB and published by Microids. It is a simulation adventure sports casual 3D game where it lets you explore freely and at your own pace entire ski resorts and the surrounding mountains, unlock ski lifts and reach new areas by competing in challenges, or enjoy the scenery while you find your own path down the mountains. This has 94% uh, positive reviews of all time, that's from 196 reviews. So that's good, very positive. We are going to take a quick look at the options here. It's the quite strange menus. Uh, we are playing this on a pad. But I don't think we need to invert the Y axis on this one, even though that would be the correct way to use a pad. Uh, so settings, the, yes, the settings menu. Not exactly the uh, the most user friendly, I would say. But you can see that we're playing this with a uh, Open GL driver, and it is on normal shadow resolutions, full screen, proper full screen. Um, I'm not sure why it's showing that as our resolution because it is in fact set to 1440p at the moment, so. That looks a bit wrong. Never mind. But we are at 120 hertz. And we have VSync on. Well, that's your options there. Yeah, could probably work on that, but never mind. Then you've got loads of in your face text there with, with help on how these work so turn with left some stick brake with B and then you've got drifts with the triggers and brake and jump and slap you can slap things great I'm sure we'll figure it out as we uh, as we go along and then you've got credits developed in Stockholm Sweden by those people so it's obviously a small indie team game. I'm not sure what engine this is developed in. Godo or Unity seems likely. We're going to play it anyway, so you got a piece map as well. So there you go. Herkschlam. Uh, I think. So there's a little man, a little wee man. Ooh. Break. He certainly b did break. And we can rewind, apparently. Jumping. Ooh. Can we make it down to the bottom without crashing and killing ourselves? Ski lift opened, didn't it? Oh, that's nice. Oh, 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 oh. Ooh. Right lift, that one's what I want to do. Nice. Where are we then? Are we, which one are we in? I think we might be in the one at the. Oh, I'm not sure if we're in the one on the top or the one at the bottom. I guess we'll find out when we reach the top of the mountain. Now, I know that snow is supposed to be white there. 
but it looks more grey. So do not adjust your screen. There's nothing wrong with that. That is just the way the game looks. Okay, I think then we were the one at the top. We have arrived at the Hirch Elm. Our first challenge is straight ahead. Ski through the gates to start. Ooh. Yeah, get out of my way. It's a skiing thing. Not a leisure. Get out of the way, all these all these silly people. Fumbling around, waiting to be knocked off. Get into an avalanche. So, I mean, mostly we are just turning. Which is the general way that skiing works, I think. You go down the hill really fast, and if something gets in your way, turn. I saw that in a film once. I think it was better off dead. Collect more ski passes to unlock the next lift. The second challenge is waiting at the top of the Hirschelam Blam. Um, yeah. Jump. I jumped. Good. Yeah, we're going to ride the lift. I keep expecting that big blue thing to move and then nothing happens, does it? It's these little cable cars instead. This is pleasant enough so far. It's uh, not demanding of my time and energy. It's just nice, chill and relaxed game so far. No grizzly bears to shoot. No foxes. No wolves, no cougars. No pirates. Um, the little adventure, we've got to go this way. It's new, okay. It's a different ski run this time. Same mountain. I wonder if these ski tracks stay. So if I go down this again, whether I'll see the tracks that I've placed there. Oh, that was a bit of a stutter. Gate missed. Wasn't very nice. dark. I don't think skiing in night is a good idea. I might be wrong. Maybe it's fun. Fun and fine. I must say that these um, ski lifts seem to be travelling rather rapidly. Be some scary adventure on that lift I think I missed the gate on there I'm not sure quite how New challenge finish. What did I miss? How did I miss the gates before then? I don't know. You've collected enough ski passes to open the second lift. Use the peace map to find it. Um, how do we get the map up then? There we go. Aha. 
Place Market Air. It's a chairlift this time. You can also use lifts from the Peace Map. Doesn't look very safe, does it? Just sitting on a bench, hitting trees. Right on the edge there as well. You have arrived at the Hirschlaum Wand. Will the March Hour to get down? There is a moderate avalanche risk. So be alert. And what are we going to do as an avalanche then? Apart from be covered in snow. Off to Peast Trail. This doesn't sound very uh, sensible. Why is somebody shooting things? Oh, we did a little jump. We're obviously an expert skier then. Oh, we didn't. We didn't die in a uh, ten foot of snow. Once you visit the lift, you can fast travel directly to it. Open the peace map and select the lift and fast travel. Uh, uh. I think that needs three. No, oh, no, that's a place to mark in there. Right, left. Ah. Well, we did, in fact, ride the lift. Spread your skis in the air to fly longer. Handy to know. You've arrived at the sunny glacier of Hirschlam. Be careful of crevices and sunburns. I don't know what a sunburn is. I'm assuming not good. It's getting colder, but if you don't like snow, but you do fancy the idea of skiing, I guess this is getting quite close to fulfilling that goal. I remember the first ski game I ever played. It was called Horace Goes Skiing on the ZX Spectrum. A classic. Not only did you have to ski down a snowy mountain and go between flags, you also had to cross a road. Very frog-like. There are lots of ski passes and trails hidden around the mountain. Take a tour outside the slope and try and find some. How do we do that then? We can now visit Walt Waltal. A remote ski resort in southern Germany known for its foggy forests and windy peaks. Use the beast map in order to get there. Next mountain. Travel. Welcome to Waldtal. A remote ski resort located 
at the end of Grands Valley. The resort is only accessible by train and the track is often closed due to rock falls and avalanches. Therefore, you can get to the resort almost to yourself if you get lucky. Doesn't look like we got lucky today then. We're just going to go skiing where we like. Nobody telling us what to do. Um. There's a lift. Slapping of the skiers gives a speed bonus. It doesn't give us a very neighbourly bonus, though, does it? What's that? And how the hell do we get to it? Do we have to ski onto the log? It. We've managed to do it though. New challenge finished. Bit of a snow plant. Ooh. And we'll go here again. Landing tricks give slight speed bonuses. Mm, lots of trees. Gate missed. You bollocks. Oh, there's a bear. I was saying there aren't any bears, and then there's a great big bloody bear. Hmm. Let's try that again then. New ski pass collected. We've got four of them now. Let's go up the hill. But we're not going to do it like that, so... No, we're going to place the marker there.
Come on then. Bit higher up the mountain. In our little cable car. And we will try to avoid grizzly bears. Stay on the mountain. There we go. No, why are you shooting? Whoever's setting the avalanches up needs to stop that. Jump the fence, look at us go. Oh, you little shit bag. Slow down a bit now. We finished with bronze. But we won. We can change the camera, can we? Oh, we can zoom out. Default far. Yeah. Default and far. Not a great, great lot of difference. Why have you gotten all stuttery again? Ten key ski passes to unlock. Twelve. About that one. Well, we can unlock it then, can't we? Do we have three? Well, they said we had three. Why is it not fast travelling us to that then? In. There's our wooden track. We get faster as we go further along, it's not uh, that surprising. But... Sometimes when you're going really fast, it's getting a bit difficult to control him. New challenge finished. Oh, 
but we didn't do terribly well then, I don't think. We didn't even get bronze. Doing any better this time. Challenge finished. Yeah, we didn't even do as well as last time. Right, this time, this time we're going to do it. Remember, there's a steep turn at the end of here. I score silver. Good. And we got two ski passes for that one. Right. So how many have we got now then? Can we unlock that then? No, that needs five ski passes apparently. We need one more ski pass. And we go to the next mountain. We need eight ski passes. Okay. Fast travel to that one. Uh, the fast traveling is a little bit confusing. How do we actually get to it? And I think that's it. That's the one that we wanted. Ride the lift. Even more dodgy ski lift this time. It's down here. Glacier. Get points for performing spins, flips, and trails. So, well, how do we do those then? Oh, we did a, that's a, a thing there. That was with the um, new challenge finished. Um, we got no points. All right. Maybe we need to use the right stick. An unfortunate landing. An unfortunate landing. Well, how are we supposed to do that then? Because I can't flip any faster than I was. Okay, we did something then. New high school bronze. Great. Maybe we can do even better. Uh, 
Um, ouch. Yes, I think we got silver. Nice. Right, what have we not done on this mountain then? This one. So we can go on the voyage. Try. I don't know whether we're doing this right or not. Two ski passes collected. Sixteen ski passes. Nice. There's a help section in the menu explaining the controls, which is useful because we were doing that really badly, weren't we? So, what is that? We found a backpack. Open the backpack to change equipment and use items. Where's our backpack then? Backpack. Carving skis. Equipped. We don't have, oh, we've got the carving board. Nice. Backpack. Items. You don't have a snow globe. Well, what did we just collect then? We now have a snowboard rather than a ski. Will that help us? I have no idea. But I think it's cooler, isn't it? Probably. Right, I think we've done all we can on this map. Oh. When we're on the ski lift, it doesn't actually let us go to the menu. Oh, we can speed things up by holding A. Right. Ooh. That's our ski a bit. I think we've done all the ones on this one now, haven't we? Well, these are hidden trails though, aren't they? I think. Let's try and get to a sparkling spot. No, I don't want to go to the challenge. I want to try and get to this sparkling spot. I think if we keep going that way, we might reach it. I don't care about missing the gate. I wasn't trying to get to the gate. I was trying to get... Ooh, there, look. There's a sparkling thing. Come on. New speed, uh, ski pass collected. So where are we on the mountain? Let's try and get down there. So we need to do a 
A one six, the one eighty ish. Okay. So we're far now. You can't actually put a marker on those sparkly bits, which is a bit annoying. We want to try and come down. A bit more. I think we're heading in about the right direction there. We gone past it? No. Should be around here somewhere. There it is. There it is. New ski pass collected. Good. What else have we got? There's a thing over to our left. Can we get over there? We can. Will we be able to get over the road? That's the question. This is just too hard for me. Oops, bubble trouble. Not sure about that. It was a bit difficult to see what we were doing there, what with it, the camera angle. Alright, is there anything else? Well, I mean, there's these things up here. Way to ski pass. We want to try and get to that bit there then. There's some purple ones there. There's a lot of hidden things. Can we get over there? We can. What we want to get... Oh. Oops. Wrecked snowboard. You get wrecked. New ski pass collected at the restaurant. The Schnitzel restaurant, no less. I'll take your Wiener Schnitzel. Okay. Can we get down here without dying? Should be another one here somewhere. Oh, it's on there. Okay.
don't want to go to the challenge though. I want to go down here. New ski pass collected, the pitfall. Ouchie. A new trick. Uh -huh. Can't jump over that. Can get to there though. So. That's where we wrecked. Ah, I wonder if we have to jump down that to get onto that. That could be tricky. That could definitely be tricky. Well, this looks like a trail, but it's not letting us go any further than that. We can go to the next mountain now. Can we unlock these things now? Have we got to unlock... heading straight down there should be I reckon a ski pass there so all of these gold ones I think are ski passes So, if you follow that marker, this will unlock that ski pass. Or that chairlift, rather. And then we should make it easier to get the other ski pass. Oh, fence. Camera is a bit shit, to be honest. Oh, we managed to get past it there. There we go. All right, so we can zoom that up, which is good. Let's go down the ride, down the slalom. Good, gold. We got gold and three ski passes. That a northern lights reflected from the sky. We have 63 ski passes, so why aren't these things unlocked then? We 
need another four, do we? There looks to be a ski pass just there, though. It's a trail. Yeah, I don't really care about the, the gates, though. I just want the... Uh... Right, so we need to go to the right. And we need to go and even a little bit more ice. Ah. Uh, I think there it is. Now, uh, to get to that one, we've got to grind on that wooden log thing. Hmm. That might be a bit tricky. Discovered. Right, we need to go more to the right. Uh, again, it's in the air, look. Mm, these, um, these other ski passes are getting harder to get to. Yeah. What about trying to get to that one? I never did. Come on. Got it. Jump the fence. Nice. Didn't manage to jump the second one though. Okay. Don't care about the gate. Go down here. Ooh. Oh yeah, that was a big jump. Should be around here somewhere. That's a lot of bears. I, I, I've never seen that many bears. We only need two more ski passes to unlock El Naka. And if any of these bears get us, I think we're going to be El Nackered. I wonder if we can get run over by one of the trains. Should we find out? The answer to that would be yes. It's like the thought of everything in this game. Nice. 
find ski passes to unlock. Hmm. I think this is not too bad. I mean, I think you're going to have to like skiing to get the most out of it. But it seems to control nicely. I do like that there's lots of little things to unlock and things. Lots of little things to discover. I wish the requirements weren't quite as strict as they are because look, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There's another ten to unlock. And it's already starting to be tough going just on the second mountain. Um, so I think I'd like these to all be unlocked. Or for the way to be all unlocked. We don't happen to go through all that rigmarole of doing the same thing all the time just to see what they're like. Because I quite like these mountains, they're quite fun. You can pick this one up for £15. So it's not a bad price, I think, for, for what it is. It certainly fulfills its uh, stated aim to simulate skiing on a ski resort. And I quite like it. I think it looks pleasant enough. It controls nicely. And um, I think there's some fun to be having on this one for 15 pounds. But that is all for me for today. I shall be back again on Wednesday with another game from my pile of shame. Till then, I hope you have a pleasant Sunday. And I shall see you later.